So let's take a look at the rig balancing feature in the 11 rack. Now you can use rig balancing to adjust the balance between the volumes when you go from rig to rig. You may not want a steep drop in volume or increase in volume when switching from rig to rig. So to adjust that, we'll hold the edit back button for about two to three seconds. Which brings us to the user options menu. You notice we have four pages. So we scroll down to the second page, which is here. And then we scroll further down to rig balancing. Then we press SW1 to select it. Now the first thing you'll notice is that it drops you in on the rig that you had selected. So let's see that. So if I hit edit back to go back, you'll see that we're on U3 plexiglass. If I move this to U2, hold edit back for two seconds rig balancing, it drops us in at U2. So we'll change back to U3. You will also notice if you have Pro Tools open that when you switch a rig here you will see it reflected in the 11 rack window in Pro Tools. So take a look at that. We're on U3 plexiglass rhythm. If I change this to U4 our rig changes it is now loaded up into the 11 rack and is reflected on the 11 rack window in Pro Tools. So rig balancing. You see now that our level is minus 8.2 dB and this number is also reflected in the 11 rack window. Right where it says volume you'll notice that it says minus 8.2. If we change this on the 11 rack you'll see that number changes. The same holds true if we adjust the volume in the 11 rack window. So now let's see some rig balancing. Well, that may be too quiet for you, so let's adjust this a bit louder. And we'll say that's good, and then we'll move on to our next rig using the scroll knob. Now you may think I made a mistake by not saving, but you'll notice when I scroll back to the U3 plexiglass rhythm rig our setting has been retained. So now let's scroll back to the U4 patch. Let's say for whatever reason we want this rig to be even quieter than it is. We'll adjust that. Then we'll move on. And we need that one louder. And then you can just continue going through all your rigs or just the rigs you want and adjusting the level. When you're done, you'd hit the edit back button, which is highlighted in green here. So we press that and you'll notice that all our settings that we made will be automatically saved by the 11 rack. And it drops it back into this menu and you can keep going through changing other options or hit edit back again and that takes you right back to the main screen.